Hey everyone! Today I want to talk about something super cool, passive income streams for artists. So let's dive in while I'm painting this rose oil painting. So imagine waking up in the morning and taking a peek over to your phone or computer, seeing that you had some cash flow your way while you were in Dreamland. Cool, right? Let me introduce you to the beauty and wonders of passive income. It's amazing that you can spend a bit of time setting something up and see the cash flowing in with little further effort. I know, you might be saying, but can't I make all of my money from my paintings? Sure, you definitely can. But wouldn't it be great to be making additional cash on top of what you're already making from direct art sales? Setting up passive income streams as an artist is a wonderful way to ensure that you have a more steady paycheck flowing your way. I have sorted my list by how easy it is to set the methods up, starting with easy mode and working up to expert mode. It's important to note here that in most cases, a bit of extra effort can go a long way, and the more difficult methods often yield much higher payoffs. So enough talk, let's find out what the methods are. So the first one, super easy mode, is Amazon Affiliate Links. Amazon Affiliate Links are a super easy mode way to start seeing some passive cash flow. By creating an account, you can post links to products found on Amazon, and when someone clicks your links and makes a purchase, you get a portion of the profits. Pretty sweet, right? The great thing about Amazon is that everybody knows about it and has so much to offer, including art supplies, so it's a great way for you to share about the brands that you will use with your audience. As your audience begins to trust you, artists within that crowd will trust your recommendation for art supplies too and will often buy what you recommend, because clearly you're doing something right. These links are super easy to pop into blog posts, into social media descriptions, a resources page on your website, YouTube video descriptions. The possibilities are endless. So to recap, Amazon affiliate links, they're pretty straightforward and easy to get started. You create an account, and then you start choosing the products that you would like to endorse. You could choose things that you use and have talked about, and people are more likely to trust this rather than random products. You can post a list of the products on your blog, website, YouTube descriptions, social media, and you get a portion of the profits with each purchase. So now let's look at the next one, easy mode, print on demand services. So this beautiful digital age that we're currently living in allows us a ton of freedom when it comes to where we can sell our art and products. It no longer takes a huge investment to start selling things like shirts with your art on it. Enter print on demand services. There are a ton of great websites out there that will allow you to create an account, upload some images and start making a profit off your sales. Some great and popular sites are Redbubble, Society6, Fine Art America, Zazzle, and more. Most of the bigger sites are constantly adding new items, so you can have your art printed on tons of different products. I've had banners made that I use for my art shows, I've got a few t-shirts, mugs, and tote bags with my art on them. While these sites do make it super easy to create printed gear, you'll have to do most of your own advertising in order to sell most cases, so do keep this in mind. So let's recap print-on-demand services. You can do shirts, bags, fabric, mugs, prints, you name it. So many sites like Redbubble, Society6, Fine Art America, Saatchi Art, Cafe Press, Zazzle, and many, many more. You can create an account and upload high resolution images and start selling. And these sites usually require you to do your own advertising. All right, so let's look at our next one. Intermediate mode, create a digital product. Digital products are an awesome way to supplement your income. And since you can create it once and sell it indefinitely, it can be a key component to your passive income stream. My favorite digital products to create are instructional ebooks on how to paint certain subjects. I use Adobe InDesign to create my ebook PDF files, but Canva is an amazing free resource that makes things super easy for you. Add them as an item to your shop, so from your website or even an Etsy shop, and upload the file for download. Voila! 
unlimited sales and downloads from one product that you created. So let's quickly recap, creating a digital product. You do eBooks, something like painting instructions, though the possibilities are truly endless here. You can do print offs like cards, or you could do other downloadable graphics. Next up is hard mode. Teach a class on Skillshare. Skillshare is an amazing platform that allows users to sign up for a monthly payment to have access to an entire database of courses. These courses are typically targeted towards creative types and entrepreneurs. Hey, that's us. And they are an incredible way to boost a huge range of skills. The classes use a video format for teaching, so creating your first class can have a bit of a learning curve if you're not super familiar with video. As a creator, you're given a link to refer people to sign up, and what's super cool is that you can earn $10 every time someone signs up using your link. And since they can usually get the first month or two free, people tend to be pretty casual with this, which means that is way more cash for you. Creators also get a portion of the royalties each month, depending on both your views and the total viewership pot each month. It can take some time to create your course, but once you do, it is so worth it. Helping others while making cash is such an incredible thing. So let's recap teaching a class on Skillshare. It's a paid platform that utilizes video format for classes. It's geared towards creatives and entrepreneurs. There is an art section, so you can easily teach a specific skill or teach about business. As a creator, you have a link that allows new students to get up to two months free, and you get $10 every time someone signs up. You can get a portion of the pot each month based on your views, and it can take time to create a course, but once it's done, you just need to advertise it and you're golden. And finally, we have expert mode. Start a YouTube channel. Ironically, this was actually my second form of passive income on this list. Guess I like to start with the challenge. YouTube is an incredible video-based platform that is quite unique in its class. It allows creators to form their own channel filled with videos of their pleasing. Now, starting a YouTube channel is not for the faint of heart. It requires a lot of work to start and maintain, but it can be a hugely rewarding project. I've had a YouTube channel for a few years, and I'm so glad that I started when I did, which is to say I started when I was completely terrified of it and stumbled my way through it. But I did it. From my experience, YouTube is one of the rare platforms that actually shows an overall upward viewer trend month after month, even if you post zero new content. I think this is largely due to the embedded recommended feed that YouTube curates for each viewer. This allows your content, even your old content, to stay super fresh and in front of new viewers constantly. Even when I go a month or two without posting new content, my sus subscriber and view count just keep rising. And in a world that otherwise demands constant input for fear of fading away, this is a hugely refreshing and welcome thing. Once you hit a certain threshold for subscribers and minutes watch, you could monetize your account and have cash flowing in each month. The easy mode for artists is to simply film yourself while painting and upload the video. I created an awesome guide for getting started with filming yourself while painting, so check it out in the description if this expert mode idea is your jam. Most of my affiliate link clicks come from the links I have included for my supplies in the description, so this works wonderfully with the first item on this list as well. What earns us method the expert mode title is that it can take some time and effort to gain traction on YouTube. You'll find the most success by actually building a channel and filling your feed with amazing videos that your viewers will love, and of course, showcasing your amazing personality. YouTube is near and dear to my heart, so hopefully you will find an appreciation for it too. So let's recap our final method, starting a YouTube channel. So YouTube is a unique platform in the way that it does a lot of internal advertising for you with recommended feeds. My experience has that has been, even though I haven't posted for a while, the overall trend is that I'm still constantly growing. Once you hit a certain low threshold, you can monetize your account. Easy mode for artists is by filming yourself while painting and uploading it. You can add free music from the YouTube library. You can include affiliate links and links to other things in the description. 
and it's considered expert mode because the most benefit comes from building an actual channel rather than just posting once. All right, well, that brings our list to a close. Hopefully, this list has inspired you to start exploring your passive income options. Post in the comments below your favorite way to earn passive income and give other people ideas as well. See you next time.